The death of a young man who went into a seizure while attending a spiritual cleansing ceremony at a local church has been ruled an accident. Investigative reporter Carla Ray first exposed the ceremonies at the Soul Quest Church of the Mother Earth two years ago, and she broke the story about a death there in April. Carla learned the autopsy lays out how the ceremony may have played a role, though, in that death. Behind the SoulQuest Ayahuasca Church, this is the backyard where a 22-year-old retreat attendee went into a seizure in April that led to his death. This autopsy, just obtained by Nine Investigates, shows the death is classified as an accident after excessive water ingestion led to hyponatremia, or low sodium levels in the blood, which caused the seizure. We want to take him to the hospital, but currently right now, it might be just faster for you guys to come here instead of us taking him. He's unresponsive. SoulQuest owner Christopher Young, who showed Nine Investigates around the property last summer, made that call to 911. And he told investigators the man had been given a cleanse of ayahuasca and combo, which involves taking the poisonous secretions of tree frogs and poking the participant with the secretion, usually with a hot metal. The autopsy states, quote, the foreign substances and chemicals potentially involved in the soul cleansing weekend cannot be ruled in or out as a causative or contributory to the death, noting the man's toxicology results were negative, but that significant time passed that could have allowed substances to leave his system. A nine investigates review of records from the scene uncovered a three hour delay between when church leaders noticed the man was in distress and when they called for help. Carla Ray reporting. Again, the Orange County Sheriff's Office is still investigating this case. Carla reached out to SoulQuest owner Christopher Young today and has not heard back as of yet. She also spoke with the father of the man who died. He says they've hired an attorney and this is not over for them yet.